Hello guys, welcome to another episode of the Vault Hunters Experience Where last time We built that hut And done some other stuff that I don't remember What to do But this time We're gonna be preparing For in the future episodes Hopefully the next episode or One after that we will see To finally go to the end and Finish the game Well, the vanilla game Defeat the end dragon So yeah this is a today's objective. Basically, actually, we got the bow. That's okay, I can delete that. We're gonna try to get netherite ingots, brewing stands, yada yada. That sort of stuff. Also, let me just quickly check this invisible guy. Mm. Useless. I will take your leads though. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme. Where are the leads? Gimme the leads. <laughs> that invisibility potion is actually working really well. Oh, go, stop. Dude. But yeah, in between episodes, I've been... I've been... I've been a farmer boy! <laughs> I've been farming. And I got a bunch of books. And also... A bunch of bookshelves so we can finally basically finish that enchanting hut so let me just do that store this real quickly just look at all this beef that i got don't don't ask how i got it it doesn't matter doesn't matter <laughs> just it magically appeared there was no unaliving none at all also a lot of leather and quite a bit of sugar cane. Uh, but yeah, let's let's just place these bookshelves down and I don't know, maybe we can enchant something. Also I hope I made enough. There there there. Is this level 30? It is, okay. Awesome. Hmm I actually think I'm gonna Yeah. This is better. A full A full view. Also, stairs over here would look much better. Does it look better actually? I don't know. I actually think it looks worse somehow. <laughs> oh, no. Jesus. Let's make a crafting table for this place. Because clearly I'm gonna be needing it. There. What should I ch enchant? I mean, I don't actually need to enchant anything. I don't think I do. So, we're just gonna leave this stuff here. It's it's gonna be useful. I suppose a few books and some lapis. Um, well, in between episodes I was grinding and trying to get some levels. But I guess I'm not gonna be using it, actually. You know, I mean to do that. Where's Lapis? Thirty-two. Okay. But yeah, guys. Hope you're enjoying the series. Uh, as always, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and leave some comments telling me how are you enjoying these episodes. But yeah. How are our villagers? All good in here. I wanted to show you, look at all the emeralds I got. I've been really a proper farmer boy. <laughs> but let's check that book and see what we should do. A brewing stand, potions, brewing hearts, start falling. Actually, you know what guys? Let me get into the nether and try to get some netherite. Because we, we need just one more netherite, I believe, yes. So we can get at least one piece of netherite armor. So let me do that. Okay. I suppose I should just make a path down and... Go to level 12, I believe? Is it 12? I think it's 12. So yeah. Let's speed this up.
Let it go, guys. And I mean, I've been mining in the straight line forever. And then I just randomly decide to vein mine a bit sideways. And I got it. It's two. Awesome. Let me just double check there's no lava because the, there was a lot of lava. You see? There's just a lot of lava on the way. Come on, disappear. Okay. One. And two. Good. This is what we came for, guys. Um, I think one piece of armor is gonna be enough. So I'm just gonna finish here. Also, I came across these dimensional shards. I have no idea what they are. I have also no idea what they're used for. So when I find these different types of um, new ores and stuff and I'm not sure what they're used for, I'm, I don't know, maybe I'm gonna mine them, maybe I'm not. I'll see. I won't really focus on gathering too many ores, uh, but as we progress through different mods, when we find the need to find some ores, that's when we're gonna, I'm gonna go searching for them but until then this is how i'm gonna do so let me return back home and gather s gather my resources and stuff and organize and all that good stuff okay guys i'm back but i got a lot of netherrack and i don't want to waste it but we're gonna have a storage situation you see I mean, I'm full, basically. So, luckily, we can do this. We can compress it into compressed netherrack. Yeah. So, but this is only a short-term solution. <laughs> Eventually, we're gonna need to do something about all of this. <laughs> well, it's actually a pretty simple solution. Because we just have to unlock, what is it, some storage mods. There are a bunch of different mods, but they also have different costs. See, the, this one costs two research stars, four. For example, applied energistics is four research stars. So, we'll see, we're, <laughs> we're quite a long way from that. But I believe I can also compress dirt. So let me do that. Dirt, okay. Yes, 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 yes. Awesome, okay. This is a bit better. Okay. But again, this is, <laughs> this is just temporary. Actually, I believe there are also more chests, right? Maybe we can unlock this. Metal barrels, iron chests. Okay. That could be a solution. Also got quite a bit of gold, actually. Let's see how much we got. 25 gold, I mean, not bad. Well, actually, <laughs> we got plenty of gold, I see. And of course, two ancient debris. Let me just quickly smelt this. Also, I think we got some blast furnaces last time, or a few episodes back, and a smoker, okay. How do I make a smoker again? Okay, just locks and a furnace. I have a furnace. I have the locks here. One, two, three, four. Okay. Let's do this. Let's just add a bit more to this. This area. There we go. I'm gonna eventually need to make a kitchen area <laughs> because this is, yeah. Well, honestly, we, I'm eventually, we're eventually gonna need to, oh. <laughs> gonna need to <laughs> upgrade this whole house because it's currently a little, it's meh, it's meh. Okay, guys, but yeah, there, a, a few more furnaces. And also now I can start smoking some beef. There we go. Oh, that's not gonna be enough, is it? 
And we got the ancient debris. It's time for our first dead writing god. That's what it's called. Also, go away. It's it takes four, right? I believe, and four gold. Let me see. Something like this. All right. Oh, I need the. Uh, what what is it called? Smithing? Yeah, damn. Uh, I'm doing good today. I remember all the names. <laughs> this is pretty rare, guys, right? Because <laughs> I have a tendency to forget all sorts of things. All sorts of things. Mm, I suppose here. What to upgrade? I think I'm just gonna upgrade my chest plate. There we go! Guys! Our first netherite armor piece. But with this, I am feeling quite a bit more confident in fighting the dragon. So, we're doing good guys. Honestly, we're basically prepared pretty much. The only other thing I would wish is... So we got another right thing, that's awesome. Let's take this off the list. Yeah. I think, just in case, I would like to take a few potions with me. Yes. I'm gonna do this. Also, eventually... Let me add this. If we m we're gonna ma be making potions, we need the uh, Nether Wards farm. There we go. We're gonna need to put that somewhere. But for the brewing hut and brewing stands, I was thinking something like this. You know those. Hmm. What is it? Those churches that the villagers have. You know which ones I mean? Let me show you. These churches I'm talking about. Well, I want it to be placed over here. Exactly over here. Well, I have no blocks, but here. So, you know, we can, because the villagers are using it as a brewing station, because they have a brewing station in there, and an alchemist, right? So, maybe if some of the villagers from in here, the villager home, want to become an alchemist, they can just go over there. And we have a little bit of community, and two in one, we also have a little, a little church. So, yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna... Basically make the same church, villager church, over here and have it as my brewing station. But I am gonna make it a bit nicer and maybe just a tiny bit bigger so we can fit more brewing stands inside. So let me get some blocks, organize, organize make some plans and see how this looks. Okay, let's start. So first I think I'm just gonna expand this a little bit. Because I will actually, uh, I will try to stick to the design of the original churches. I do have a picture over here in, on my phone, uh, on the table. <laughs> um, but yeah, I am gonna change it a bit also. I'm gonna make it out of this fancier cobblestone, stone bricks, whatever. Let's see how this is gonna look. So it's also nice because when the visitors come into our village, first thing they see over here is the church. So, I don't know. They can be religious or something. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever they fancy. Okay, so let me see how this begins. I guess the entrance is first. So let's say the, the church starts here. 
there. I'm gonna make it a three wide entrance and something like this. Then it goes goes there, but I want to make it a bit wider, so something like that. Because I do want to fit quite a few brewing stands inside. Okay, four and then something like this maybe. So two to the side and over here. Hmm. I guess this works. <laughs> this is quite a bit of a bigger church, I, I realize, but I do want a lot of brewing stands because at least in the early game, we're going to be rel relying on brewing stands quite a lot, actually. So, oh, I don't have a <laughs> picture of the back, but something like this. Stairs up and then we enter and we can have some windows and stuff. Yeah. Maybe like a window here. I got some paints. I think, guys, let me build. Or I might make a time lapse. I don't know yet. And then we will see what happens. Okay, this is what I have so far. I think I'm I'm kind of liking it also from afar. Uh, I'm gonna make a wooden roof, but we have some mosaics. Well, not what are they called? Well, the painted windows because they are also in churches, right? That's what they have. That's very usual. We're gonna have a red carpet, I think. I think that's. That looks nice. And then just a bunch of brewing stands in here. <laughs> I can also barely fit through. But okay. Let me continue building and make a roof. And hopefully we can make some potions in this episode.
Okay, guys, I think this is it. I'm, I'm incredibly happy with this building. Just look at it from afar. Let me show you this. I mean, it looks awesome. This turned out way better than I expected. I really didn't expect it to look this good. Also, I, I have a bell on the top, some yellow glass panes. I mean, it just looks so awesome. I really like it. Also from the sides, I have the wooden roof over there. I mean... Excuse me. Damn, got a violent coughing attack. Only from the rear, I don't really like it, but... Honestly, we are not coming from the rear that often. Maybe at some point, I'm gonna change this up. Because I... this... It really doesn't look that good. Actually, I guess I can try this. Some stairs to make it look a little bit better. But still, this is uh, such a flat rear. But also on the inside, I, I, I really like how this looks. I mean, okay, the doors are a bit awkward. But hey, just look at the inside. It's... It's a bit of an open <laughs> open roof design, but I mean, I think it looks awesome. And you can have so many brewing stands in here. And speaking of brewing stands, let me go grab some and maybe even make a few more. I even grabbed the chest and I'm gonna put it here. A spruce chest. That looks kind of cool, doesn't it? I kind of said I didn't use it before. <laughs> I think it looks really awesome. And the uh, crafting table over there. I mean, it's a bit unusual to have a crafting table, but trust me, we're gonna be using it, I'm sure. So, how many? Let's see. I just think. Put this torch. I'm just gonna put them all around. Oh, okay. One. One, two, three, four, five, six more. Because the one thing I hate is making potions. And it takes forever to make potions. And over here, we can make a lot of potions at once. And actually, a really nice thing is that we have an ocean right there. So we can fill our water buckets, bottles really quickly. Ah, this looks so good. Even leave some blaze rod in here for the blaze powder. I mean, this building doesn't really need a sign, does it? <laughs> I mean, it's pretty obvious what it is. I love it. I I really think that looks amazing. Yeah, it looks perfect. It, it it looks better than I could have imagined. So brewing hut, church, definitely done. Potions, okay. We need to make some potions. I'm gonna make some health potions. Maybe a regeneration potion. I don't know yet. Also, I'm gonna try to make slow falling. I'm not sure what I need to even for the slow. If slow falling. I guess we can make this. Yeah, for sure. So now what, guys? In this last part of the episode, I'm just gonna prepare a bunch of stuff to hopefully in the next episode fight the Ender Dragon. So let me gra grab just a few things for this. Potions. <laughs> some golden apples mm. oh it's the it's blocks right that's why we need a lot of gold a lot of gold okay bunch of gold is gonna just disappear now there we go bye bye gold 
<laughs> then that is really a lot of gold. And only four golden apples. Oh, we have four already, so that's nice. Just look at all these gorgeous water bottles. Maybe I made a few too many brewing stands. <laughs> Guys, I think I'm preparing a bit too much. I may have gone too far. This is way too many health potions. But that's okay. Better to be ready. More ready than not, right? But another thing I just realized I need to do is fix up my pickaxe because this is just not gonna not gonna do. So let me go I guess craft another diamond pickaxe. Also I don't even know where to put all these portions, I suppose. For now over here. Also, uh, I tried to make a regeneration portion with the gas tier and yeah, you can't. I need Vault Essence. It's a rare essence of the vaults. It's used in that dimension, the vault. Well, you get it from there, so... Forget about <laughs> the regen regeneration potions. We're not we're not making that. <laughs> Just not happening. But yeah, I think this is plenty of health potions. I even might leave a few behind. Yeah, this is way too many, honestly. So, a diamond pickaxe, we have enough diamonds, <laughs> We, I think I need to invest in mending next. The next uh, librarian is gonna need to have some mending because this is... Yeah. Also, we can rename it, what should we name this pickaxe? Fortunato. Fortunato, <laughs> like in Italian. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I think. Do I need anything else? Let me just check the last things. Make sure I have everything. And then I suppose I can head on to the end. Well, to the stronghold. Let me make the last few checks, okay? <laughs> Okay guys, I think I'm prepared. You can check my inventory. Let me know what I'm forgetting. Also, I'm not forgetting an arrow because in this mod pack you don't need actually an arrow in your inventory to far when you have infinity. So that's really nice. But yeah, I think I'm ready. So... Where is that stronghold? I guess I'll travel over there. This is only gonna take a, a little blip, a blip, for you guys. And there we go. I made a little pathway, so let us enter our... Actually, I noticed something. There we go. <laughs> Need to mark it. Oh, okay. That was interesting. But yeah, let us enter our... Pathetic little, tiny, <laughs> really tiny stronghold. And... Well... Next time, guys. It's time to go into the end. But for this episode, guys, I hope you enjoyed. In the next episode, we are fighting the Ender Dragon. So make sure to leave a like, subscribe. Leave a comment, uh, hope you're enjoying this, epi this series, and check the next episode when we fight the end dragon. Da, da, da. Bye guys. Just look at all these gorgeous water bottles. Maybe I made a few too many brewing stands. <laughs> guys, 
I think I'm preparing a bit too much. I may have gone too far. This is way too many health potions. But that's okay. Better to be ready. More ready than not, right? But another thing I just realized I need to do is fix up my pickaxe because this is just not gonna not gonna do. So let me go I guess craft another diamond pickaxe. Also I don't even know where to put all these potions, I suppose. For now we're here. Also, uh, I tried to make a regeneration potion with the Gastir and yeah, you can't. I need Vault Essence. It's a rare essence of the vaults. It's used in that dimension, the vault. Well, you get it from there, so forget about <laughs> the regen regeneration potions. We're not, we're not making that. <laughs> Just not happening. But yeah, I think this is plenty of health potions. I even might leave a few behind. Yeah, this is way too many, honestly. So, a diamond pickaxe, we have enough diamonds, <laughs> We, I think I need to invest in mending next. The next uh, librarian is gonna need to have some mending because this is... Yeah. Also, we can rename it, what should we name this pickaxe? Fortunato. Fortunato. <laughs> like in Italian. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I think... Do I need anything else? Let me just check the last things. Make sure I have everything. And then I suppose I can head on to the end. Well, to the stronghold. Let me make the last few checks, okay? Okay guys, I think I'm prepared. You can check my inventory. Let me know what I'm forgetting. Also, I'm not forgetting an arrow because in this mod pack you don't need actually an arrow in your inventory to fire when you have infinity. So that's really nice. But yeah, I think I'm ready. So... Where is that stronghold? I guess I'll travel over there. This is only gonna take a, a little blip, a blip for you guys. And there we go. I made a little pathway. So let us enter our, actually, I noticed something. There we go, <laughs> need to mark it. Oh, okay. That was interesting. But yeah, let us enter our Pathetic little, tiny, <laughs> really tiny stronghold. And... Well... Next time, guys. It's time to go into the end. But for this episode, guys, I hope you enjoyed. In the next episode, we are fighting the Ender Dragon. So make sure to leave a like, subscribe. Leave a comment, uh, hope you're enjoying this, epi this series, and check the next episode when we fight the end dragon. Da, da, da. Bye guys.